Good morning. Time to make the coffee. Today's flavor is vanilla caramel. It's from the pack from Ollie's, their holiday coffee pack. I think it had 60 in there. And it was, I don't know, between 15 and 20 dollars. And I'm going to have it with vanilla creamer because I have some vanilla creamer here that needs to be used up. So on my mission here to use up some of my food, I'm not going to do another whole year cook down, but if you're interested in that, I have a whole year of cooking videos of where I'm using up my food. So today it's only going to be 36 degrees, but right now it's in the teens. It's like 16 degrees, so it's cold out there. And I looked at the weather here. I live on the north coast here in Ohio, not right on the lake, but close enough. And um, our weather for this week is going to be kind of up and down everywhere, in the 30s all the way up to the upper 50s. So the upper 50s, that's good. But there's a lot of people getting sick now, especially when the weather is all over the place. The bugaboos like to stalk you. So, um, I'm not even going to say anything about me. I don't want to jinx myself. So, um, I don't know. I think I'm going to stay home today. My handyman fellow didn't show up yesterday. So... He might be coming today. I don't know. He's kind of a last-minute kind of guy. He shows up eventually. So, uh, and there's really nowhere that I have to go. So, I do have to go to my mom's at some point and just hang out with her and take her shopping. She likes to go to the stores. And since she's kind of isolated a little bit more now since she's not driving... That was kind of her social uh, outlet for the week. She'd go hang out at Mark's and see what they had in the way of bargains. But, uh, yeah, she, she finally decided, you know, she made the wise decision of saying, no, I'm not going to drive anymore. So, and I was happy about that. I mean, she hasn't driven far in years. Mark's was like, a oh, quarter mile from her house, if even that much. I could probably still walk there. So anyway, life goes on, and if God grants me the privilege of living to a ripe old age as my mom, she's going to be 95 in April, then, you know, I'll be facing these things too. So it's a little bit like looking in the mirror at future me. But anyway, she's doing well. So, all right, let's put some creamer in the coffee. And that is a tall mug. This is the kind of mug where it would probably be better if I used loose coffee. In the loose coffee pod that came with my um, pot, with my coffee maker. But I've got plenty of K-cups, so I'll just use those. All right, let's give the coffee a try. Cheers. Oh, that's good. I haven't had vanilla coffee with vanilla creamer in a very, very long time. So, all right, I'm going to enjoy this coffee. And then I will meet you at the budget book. Right back at the budget book. Oh, look at all that red. That doesn't make me happy. <laughs> but the stuff I got made makes me happy. Uh, so anyway, yesterday I didn't spend any money. I stayed home. I was fooling around with my fireplace, trying to get an idea of what I'm going to do permanently. And I think I have it figured out. Um, at least I have to um, still paint some of the tiles now black 
and then I have to put them on permanently. Uh, yesterday I had a little preview in yesterday's video of what it's going to look like. So I think it'll look nice. I'm happy with my ideas. And uh, it, it just makes it a little fancier, makes the room a little more um, not so plain. I mean, my room's not plain, but the fireplace was. So I think it'll look nice, and I think I'll enjoy it, because I do look at the fireplace. I have mini lights up there, and I have candles that I burn. And around Christmas time, I have usually a nativity. Last, or, yeah, last Christmas, I had a, a village there because I didn't go up in my attic. So I do look at my fireplace quite a bit. And then, of course, I have the faux fire in there, which is also a heater. Um, so, yeah, I like my fireplace. But I just wanted to fancy it up, make it a little bit more cohesive with the room. So anyway, a couple of you were asking why I don't do no spends anymore. Well, I do no spends. I mean, these green days are no spends. But the reason I haven't been doing uh, chunks of no spend is because I'm fixing up my house with, uh, I'm refreshing it. So that requires me to either use what I have and redesign with that which I'm doing but then also I have new ideas of how I want the room to look. My uh, living room was a uh, very old world before and now it's boho so that requires me to buy some new things too. So that's what I'm up to plus that I paid off my and this is the major reason why I'm not doing big chunks of no spend is because I paid off my car and I paid off uh, a loan that I had for a few years so I have a little bit of extra cash that now I can afford to buy the things I want to refresh my house so that's what I'm going to do I know some of you enjoyed the no spend chunks and I'm going to return to that at some point because I still have to save up some money to finish paying for my windows and uh, I have most of the money. I already paid for one of the windows uh, but I still have a little bit to go so I'll be doing some chunks of no spend for that but right now my uh, focus is on freshening up my house, fixing it up, things that are breaking down after 20 years, and uh, that's what I'm doing. So, and as far as the cooking goes, uh, I still do cook. If it's something interesting, I share those videos. But if I'm just pulling something out of the freezer, which is also one of my goals to use up some of my freezer food and make a little more room in there, it's not very interesting, so I'll just do a very short blurb on uh, what I'm cooking down. So anyway, life changes, people change. It's not always same old, same old. I know sometimes if we enjoy something, we would like it to stay same old, same old, but that's not the way life is. So... Um, Right now, I'm enjoying a little bit more of a financial break where it wasn't so every single penny was going to my bills. So uh, I'm happy about that. So anyway, that's it on the budget book for today. I don't know what I'm going to do today if I'm going to stay home. I can't think of anything right now that I need. I just want to finish up some of the things that I already bought supplies for. So that'll keep me busy for a while, but if I think of something else I need, I'll probably buy it if I can afford it. I'm not buying anything that I can't afford, and I'm not getting into debt, not breaking the budget, so everything's fine. All right, well, 
I'll be back. I'm going to do a little stenciling here on my fireplace. I decided to stencil it with black since the tiles are black. And I decided I'm not going to gild them. I think that might be a little much. So I don't want to overdo it. I want to keep it on the simple side. But I still want it to look nice. So this is a Dollar Tree stencil that I cut up. It was all one. And I have these little cutouts here. And I'm going to just put a little, the middle of the stencil on either side and then put part of it here. So, and I'm going to use this uh, paint pen. So we'll see how it goes. I'll show it to you once I get it done. Just working on my fireplace a little bit today. Tonight's dinner is pierogies, spinach and feta cheese. I'm going to have one of these sausages. The other one will be for another meal. And a salad, using up the rest of the that salad. And then um, the onions that I cooked. So that will be tonight's dinner and also tomorrow night's dinner. So I've been boiling my pierogies in the frying pan. Then all I have to do is drain the water, put some butter in there, and fry them up a little bit so it saves on pots and pans. And I also cook my sausage in there. So everything is made in this one frying pan. Well, here's tonight's dinner. Four pierogi, caramelized onions, some sour cream, the sausage, that is um, field roast sausage, and a salad with feta cheese, sprouts, and ranch dressing. I'm looking forward to eating this. I think that looks pretty darn good, and it's not a real expensive meal. Well, today was a very easy day. I didn't plan too much. I just kind of took the day off. It was a pajama day. The handyman didn't come. He texted me. He's going to be picking up what I need and coming over tomorrow. So we'll see. No big rush on that. I'm not doing anything in the garage for probably a couple months anyway. So um, there's really no rush for that. And I could use a break from fixing it up, fixing up stuff anyway. <laughs> it's been going on for months. So a few more things to go, and then um, I'll take a break. That's what I'll do. So anyway, short video today. I worked on my fireplace. Uh, I got the stenciling done and I like it but it's getting too dark to show you that now so I'll have to show that to you tomorrow but uh, not a very exciting day and I like days like today worked out perfectly fine so that's all I have for you today my friends I want to wish you abundant blessings I love you guys be good to yourself be good to others God bless you, and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, comment, and like. It helps my channel grow. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to share.